trespassing. As opposed to... I, I, you know, I love the, um, when games do that, when they give you this little sign that's just like, you are now doing this, <laughs> you know? Hey, you're stealing. Holy you stuff. shouldn't have murdered that guy. Now, there are guards up here. Um, have you ever played Dark Souls? I have not. There is a hilarious. Oh, we got a guard. We got a guard to dispose of. Oh. oh, but notice now that I have the upgraded dark vision, stuff I can st I can take appears as well. Oh yeah. Oh, this was awkward. The guy's awfully close. Uh, problems have solutions. Down you go. <laughs> and oh. okay. this I just did because it's quieter. Cause he's he's over that like over that over that balcony. That's where the party is. You can just sleep down there. Now this yeah. is where I kind of screwed up, because I didn't realize it at the time. But at some point while I was up here, the guards downstairs like know about my presence, but they don't come up at this point. So what will end up happening is later on I will try to go downstairs, and as soon as I come in the door, I'm just under attack. Just leave, just leave him anywhere, really. Doesn't matter. If there are any, if there's still any other living watch officers up on this floor, I'd, I might pay to be more careful. But okay, now we're up in the boil zone. Boil war metal, 150 coins. <laughs> there's quite a bit of stuff to be found here. <laughs> Oh! Oh no! I I under, I miscounted the guards. Luckily, I'm in the matrix. Oh, there goes his head. Oof. A lot easier when you have time on your side. This guy's that, that that's the one who was unconscious. So I threw him through some plate glass. Nice. Boil egg. They just name everything out of themselves. I'm gonna check out that big painting. Vera More and the affix of her skin. Now, Vera More, uh, have you. Spoiler alert Vera More is better known as Granny Rags. Oh. Long time ago. Got this head. <laughs> it wasn't enough to break the glass. Sadly. Bullets. Now I can finally properly investigate. I'll take that. I wish I could remember what this was. Lots of stuff to steal. Ooh, 25 coins. Pearl. Hmm. Well, 250. Waverly bedroom key. Ah, note to Waverly Boyle. Waverly, darling, here are three co here are three costumes for your party. It pains me that I can't be there, though I'm sure you understand why. I know you're going to look lovely in black. I've enclosed a skeleton key to Dunwall Tower. When you visit me, no barrier will come between us. HB. HB is, of course... Hiram Burroughs. Exactly. So we know that Waverly... So in case we hadn't figured out, you know, from other means, we know Waverly is the mistress. In, and she's in black. And we, the skeleton key, this will can be used in the next mission when we're breaking into Dunwall Tower. Decor. 
something else. Waverly Boyle's diary. <laughs> Esma set aside more than enough spirits for the party tonight. I shouldn't wonder. If she didn't have a drink in her hand, she'd positively lose her balance. Count on me to stay sober, especially in these critical times. Would that I could escape Dunwall entirely, for I have a terrible feeling that someone might come after me. Don't be silly. Of course not, Waverly. No one's going to harm you. Actually, don't. I managed to take that plate without disturbing the cider on it. That was impressive. <laughs> don't you promise to protect her or something? Isn't that how you lure her away? Uh, one of them is like you, pro yeah, like you tell her that she's someone's coming to kill her, and you you're gonna help her escape into the basement. I'm not sure which of the sisters that is. There's another one, like I said, she takes you into the music room to play like the harpsichord, and then one of them just lures you, asks you to come upstairs for, well, guess. Oh, there's a painting of Burroughs. Three hundred coins. Really? Yep. Well, coins. well, it's a Sokolov original. He's in demand. Yeah, it's nice. Now, there's different, other, there's different ways you can go back. You can just, you can just go back down, outside, and go in through the front door again. You can like lunge over the balcony from above. You can turn into a rat, and there's a passageway from the first floor to the second. River Crust Reproduction. Oh, joy. Oh, by Piero Joplin. I'll skip this over. I don't, I don't want to read anything Piero Joplin wrote about anything sexual, because remember, remember what he built. Yes. Powered by steam, pounding furiously. <laughs> Did we decide it was steam or coal or whale oil? Well, I think the I think the I think the burning whale oil heats the steam turbine, and I we're we're, we're overthinking this. Ah, oh, the Isle of Circonos. This is where Corvo's from. This might be worth this be worth reading. Circonos, the jewel of the South, is best known for its warm winds, spiced foods, and endless beaches. While the city of Calero sees the heaviest flow of travelers from across the isles, Karnica, on the southernmost edge of the southernmost edge of the known world, is preferred among the elites of the empire. It is said that a month spent rest, resting beneath the sun on the beaches of Circonos, or within one of the rural villages, can cure most maladies. Travelers bring back recipes and styles from the south, and the dances that all Circonans learn in their youth are favored in Gristol for their sensuality, copied by the fashionable aristocracy in the capital of Dunwall. The only persistent trouble in Circonos originates along the string of tiny islands stretching away from the mainland to the east. For generations, pirates have hidden among this archipelago, raiding traders passing between the isles and, more recently, attacking whaling ships returning with rich stores of oil. Remember, Gristol is the not England of the, of the Dishonored Universe, Circonos is the not Italy. Right. Hence the thing about, like, you know, people from further north going there when they're sick to... Like, people with tuberculosis used to go to the Mediterranean. Let's see, is there anything else up here? Pile them up. Can you toss bodies in the fire? I don't think so. Damn. That saddens me. Someone needs to mod that in. Yeah. I know it's fictional, but the architecture is actually, for the style they're going for, is actually pretty spot on. Is it? Yeah. Classically, elaborately built. I might cut some of this wandering out. Oh, sorry about that. Ah, now here's... Here's, we're back at the party. That's the wiring for the, uh, the Wall of Light. If you follow that, oh. you, can fi you can find, like, where the power source is and knock it offline. Or to where the, uh, the control panel is and rewire it. Right. Around. 
Ah, oh, this must be another bed, another basement vault key. Good, Lydia, Bo Lydia Boyle's diary. I am looking forward to the party tonight, despite the prospect of so many boorish men talking about their business failures. What I wouldn't give to meet a fine young musician in this horrible town. Someone who appreciates the harpsichord, for instance, and could write me a song. Lydia. And like I said, that ties into the way she can be dispatched. You know, something that's always kind of bothered me, do you think real, like, other people's diaries read like that? I've never read other people's diaries. I, yeah, well, like, I don't have a diary. I don't keep one. Neither do I. Like, which, I, I mean, I know people kind of find funny because, like, I, my biggest hobby is writing. Ooh, a river quest. Another but, like, I did the, you know... Yeah, I don't know. It's a good question. Well, I'm sure it varies enormously from person to person. Ooh, lots of pearls. Nice. Like I said, you can make a lot of money on this stage. There's our target. I guess you could, I suppose you could do, in theory, do a drop kill on her. I've never pulled it off, but that would be pretty cool. <laughs> well, then you'd have to make it, make your way to the door in a real, quite a hurry. You can just time stop, time slow. That's true, yeah, yeah. People are just enjoying the party, and suddenly Waverly Boyle's head just goes flying across the room for no reason. Now we're going back. And now at this point, I did not know that I'd unwittingly activated the guards downstairs, okay? Right. So I, I'm heading back now, blithely assuming that I'll just, once I go in, I'll be able to just, you know, talk and mingle as before, and, pi and pick off Ms. Waverly Boyle at my leisure. Like you do. But... What? Instead! Okay, that's what happens when that when that overseer music box activates. And I, you notice it's draining my health? Yeah. It's sucking the life right out of me. Oh, and down I go. Yeah, if there's one of those music boxes going, you gotta take that guy out immediately. Because he's not, he's not just, he's not just blocking your powers, he's hurting you. <laughs> 